The Nigerian Senate has passed for second reading a bill that would provide for the documentation and protection of domestic workers and employers of domestic workers across the country. This followed the presentation of the lead debate by sponsor of the bill, Senator Husseini Babangida, during Wednesday's plenary. The lawmakers, while leading the debate on the general principles of the bill, said most domestic workers in the country were either unregistered or not engaged in compliance with labor laws. He also noted that the country did not have a codified set of laws to cater for various cadres of domestic workers, some of whom were non-Nigerians. Mr. President, over the years, our nation has experienced an increase in the incidence of assaults and abuse of domestic workers by their employers or hosts. These abuses ranges from slave labor, physical abuse, and sexual abuse to mention a few. The stories are gory, traumatic, and mind-boggling, especially against the background that these domestic workers exist in the informal sector. They are unionists and, do not do, and they do not have a collective platform to speak for themselves, and therefore remain ostensibly vulnerable and helpless. On the other side of the coin is the rise in the state of complicity of crimes, committed by domestic workers, mostly in connivance with other criminal elements of society against their employers or hosts. In supporting the passage of the proposed bill, other lawmakers said the bill was timely considering the spate of abuse of domestic workers and attacks by them on their employers. It is very, very timely and appropriate. A few months ago, I was the Minister for Labor and employment. And a few months, I represented the president at the International Labor Organization in Geneva. And part of the focus of the liberations were not only on the rights of workers, but on the rights of, for the rights for decent work. I rise in support of this bill because of my conviction that we must go this route, particularly when this bill aims to protect domestic workers and, of course, those of us who are employing them. However, I have a question. When um, distinguished Senator Babang did the mover of this bill, let me commend you for taking this initiative and for putting this forward. However, I'm a little bit um, not so comfortable with the idea of having a commission for this purpose. Yes, it is the responsibility of the Ministry of Labor and Productivity to look at the issue of domestic workers and the rest of things like this, which is why you are in collaboration with them in the, I mean, by bringing this forward, by jointly bringing this forward. We can as a Senate or as a National Assembly, if we can regulate this, it will also reduce all these cases where you see employers refusing to give the rights that are supposed to be given to these domestic workers. And their fundamental rights are always abused. So I think there will be need for us to look at it based on this uh, bill and regulate it impose necessary fines, impose necessary uh, punishment for any abuse. And in line with that, at least from being domestic staff, you'll be able to know that you have your own rights as a citizen of this country.